Okay, I like that. Thanks for your sin. In your dreams. So, do I think that Stu Mocker is alive? I think there's a good chance of it. What is up, guys? It is your boy, Kelsey Evans, here. And today, I want to be talking about Scream 5. Well, one specific thing. Do we think that Stu Mocker, a.k.a. Matthew Lillard, is going to return for Scream 5? I hope so. Um... There's Jacqueline in the background. She's mooing. I don't know why. But it's not done eating Chinese food. Okay, anyway, the point is... Um... Scream... What? Oh. Alright, anyway. So, Scream 5 is happening. And it's going to be released in 2022. Now... That's still about a year, about a year away, and the big question is: Is Matthew Lillard returning? I hope so. The reason why I say this, he even he um he even made a like made kind of like a hint that Stu Mocker may be returning. I don't know how you uh, would consider this a clue that he might be returning, but this is what he tweeted. He tweeted, "It's just a TV, right?" I mean, you think you'd survive. If you really think about it, all the killers in Scream have gotten shot. And he was the only one who who didn't really get shot. Like, like a TV, like he got stabbed, then he got a TV uh, thrown on his head. And he just randomly tweeted that out. And it makes you think. It's like, you're right. He's the, he's the only possible killer that could actually survive. Because even in the third movie, originally, he was supposed to be the killer. However, uh, the script got changed, and we got a whole different storyline. I hate Scream 3 with a passion. Probably one of the worst horror sequels of all time. However, um, they can all turn all this around. If they come out with Scream 4 and Matthew Lillard is going to be in it, and not Scream 4, uh, Scream 5 and Matthew Lillard is going to be in it, this will make up for Scream 3. Um, yeah, so... I picture that if he returns, this is how I imagine that it will happen. I think that in the first movie, he survived, he survived, but the police knew about it, but they didn't want to tell Sydney just to help, just to, um, just to uh, protect her, so she wouldn't know. So they, I, I'm assuming he would have went to jail, and they would have had him locked up. And then, in Scream 5, somehow he gets parole... And he only comes out of jail. So something like that. And then I hear there's supposed to be like clips of like old of like the first movie, like scenes we didn't see, like Billy Loomis, who we all know died, got shot in the head by um I wanna say Sydney shot him in the head. Yep, Sydney shot him in the head. But yeah, if they come out with um the movie they have Matthew Lillard had survived, who survived the first movie and had him in jail all this time, because that would make up for like the third movie. Like the third movie was was terrible, and he was supposed to be the original killer in the third one, but they got, everything got changed. So, if they had something in which that he's been alive all these years or whatever, that would be amazing. If they can't bring back Billy; he's dead for sure. But look, Matt, uh, Stu Mocker, Matthew Lillard. Is actually one of those you can actually I can see him coming back. Um, the one character I really wanted to see come back is Randy, and I thought it was a stupid idea that they, a terrible idea, that they killed off Randy in the in the like not even halfway into Scream Two. But yeah, um, I think Matthew Lure is hinting that Stu Mocker is going to return uh, in the new Scream movie. But um, the, the thing I, I why I think I also think this is because he also uh, quickly deleted the tweet. Why would you quickly delete the tweet? That makes you think. All right, guys. So, what do you guys think that you think uh, Lillard's up for it, be in, is going to be in the new Screen Five movie, or you think it's just a diversion and something else going to happen? 
I don't know, I'm really looking forward to Scream 5. I'm ready for everyone to come back. And even if uh, Lillard doesn't make an appearance, I'm still going to be happy because I haven't seen a Scream, mo a Scream movie in about almost 10 years. So, yeah, I'm pretty happy about that. All right, what do you guys think about my, my idea? And let, let me know, know in the comments below what your predictions for Scream 5 is and if you think that Matthew Lillard is going to return. All right, stay tuned for another episode of Orange Glad You Don't Know Me, where random things are constantly always randomly happening. Signing off.